Hey team, so this is kind of a sad excuse for a video, but when you're a mom and you rarely have a babysitter and you get one for your hair appointment day, you kind of try to kill all the birds with one stone. And so I wanted to make this video to put on YouTube for my folks who are um, Sensi Consultants who are do not have Facebook and are not in our team page. Um, <clears throat> just to share with you guys some tips and tricks and things through here. Um, and so you all can be still part of the family. So this is a bag party that I have prepared and ready to go. No one has it yet, um, but I have had it with me today because I had errands to run and I didn't know if anybody was gonna wanna smell the new scents or possibly take a bag, so I was trying to be prepared. So inside of this bag, this is one of the little Scentsy totes, but you can you can really use any tote that you want to. I really like the idea of the clear totes you can get from Amazon because if people can see it, like I like this one because it's branded with Scentsy, but if people can see what's inside of it, they're gonna be more likely to ask the host who's carrying the bag what's inside of it so of course I've got um, my testers these are just these are just the um, <clears throat> fall and winter um, brand new fall and winter transition testers bag parties do not get all of my testers so that's just those and then um, I also have the Disney ones but I keep those separated with a little paper in there that says why they are separated meaning um, because they are different collection as far as pricing goes than the regular ones um, inside of here I also have things for my host to experience and even the customers so this is lemon uh, verbena all-purpose cleaner that I have made and I even have up here that it costs $18 but the concentrate makes six 16 ounce cleaners um, got this bottle at the Dollar Tree filled it up with some already pre-made cleaner for them to try and I tell them to use it all up just leave me the um, bottle so sorry y'all I'm like all over the place with this so I also keep a pen in there I always put a pen I usually have a Scentsy pen but this one is from a church so um, keep a pen in there for them so they don't have to go scrambling to find a pen um, I give them a scent circle because that's just part of my thank you for them uh, hosting and I usually have an incentive for my parties so for this one it's at a $350 party pre-tax and orders they will get a free wall fan diffuser from me for you from me um, that's just one of my incentives and again it has to be done um, personally and privately I have a sample in here of uh, first day of fall but gosh it's already trying to melt and that has been with me all day it has not even been in the heat what in the world anyway that's how quickly our waxes melt so be sure that your hosts know not to leave these in their car I usually have a warning sign um, and yeah it's a straight yellow warning sign I like attached to it that's like do not leave this in the car um, I have a little half sheet of information and it's just all about um, you know not leaving it in the car uh, local to me shoppers they get you know their shipping fees their tax fees um, online ordering how they can do that payment information I have an example of how to do an order form um, and then like some buy host join information I also have this up here about when their party's gonna close so they'll know and I'll just write the date up there with like a sharpie marker which I can erase with a um, expo pen later then I have like my little join card about my family or whatever and I got these little rings. I can't even tell you where I got these rings because this is from my teaching days forever ago. But I just whole punch it and I change this out seasonally depending on the, um, you know, catalog season. Then inside I have, um, I, I give them one full catalog and I say to keep this in the bag because I don't want it to get misplaced. Um, also on it I have my quick tips. So it's welcome to our fall winter catalog. And then I have the things in there that are important that I, that I think are important. A few of my favorite things, I've listed out some of the new products that I like, and then my top favorite scents and my information. Text me if needed, because text is best. Um, warmer of the month flyer with a sample attached for them to smell. Order forms, of course. The only thing I didn't do for these, because I literally threw this basket together this morning before I walked out of the um, house to run my errands, I would make sure that these are highlighted because you do want your customer's information for proper follow-up care. And then one thing that you can do, because this does happen a lot of times in bag parties, you'll get this back and it'll just have the person's name up there. So no phone number, no email, no nothing, okay? So what happens if um, somebody's order is back ordered? I mean, you have to go through the host to get in touch with this customer. And so that's just kind of a lot of stuff to do unnecessarily. So you need their information. So one thing that you can do is just take a sticky note and attach it to the first order form that says, Dear Host, um, please fill out all of the, get all of the highlighted information filled out and you will get an additional prize. And you can give them another scent circle or a scent of the month bar or something for free that you have on hand. Maybe even a Scentsy salad, um, which maybe I need to do a video on Scentsy salads for you guys. Um, but basically it's just a bag full of samples. And then I have an envelope for payment and order forms. And that is all that is in my bag parties though. Well, nope, it isn't. Aha, uh -huh. told you a story. I will also have another sample in here. I have two two wax samples for them to try because it's a new catalog season and I want them to try the samples. Um, I also have a room spray. People love room sprays and they're underutilized. So I do keep one of those and I tell them to use it. Use as much as you want. Um, you know, these are great and people love them in their purse. They love them in the bathrooms. 
So anyway, in your bag parties, just make sure that it's, you know, if you can help that it's branded, do that or use the clear totes that you can get off of Amazon or like clear makeup bags that you can probably find at Walmart or something. And they don't have to be extravagantly big bags or spend a lot of money on it or anything, but just so that when your host is carrying it around to work or family gatherings or whatever that people are intrigued, like, oh, Scentsy or, oh, what's in that bag? There's a lot of cool stuff in there. So you want them to be intrigued and you also want them to experience things. So make them set samples, nice healthy samples and give them scent circles and let them try things because if they try it, they're going to want to buy it or use their host rewards on it, right? Or people who um, are hosting the, you know, the guests from this party are going to see what you do as a consultant to spoil your host and they want to host with you too. So anyway, this is one of, one of my bag parties. Every time I do one, it changes. It's a little bit different and that's okay because that's the beauty of being your own business owner is you can kind of change the way you do things, make them more extra or more basic depending on your personality. I fit more in the basic area, but anyway, I hope this helps you guys and um, yeah. Let me see what your bag parties look like. Feel free to text me if I'm your sponsor and let's see. Um, but if you have any questions, let me know and I'll try to answer them. Okay, have a good day.